Hola amigos and welcome. In today's video, I'll be reviewing yet another set of magnetic eyelashes. This time, it will be the Luxilia Magnetic Eyelashes. And in honor of the name, Luxilia, like my puppers, Lux, I'm wearing this necklace right here. You guys tell me, does it look like my pup? <laughs> Alright guys, so without further ado, let's get right to it. This set of magnetic eyelashes comes with five pairs of eyelashes, one magnetic eyeliner, and a pair of tweezers. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so we are seeing the pair of tweezers right here, the magnetic liner, and the five pairs. Oops. Where did the other oh I was like where did the other pair go oh my goodness look at this guys it got it like fell and it got like smushed but actually it's not a big deal I put it on here and it seems to be all right alrighty then little mishap there but um okay so these are the five pairs of magnetic eyelashes and if you guys notice it had like a little card here and the card is a thank you card which I'm assuming it has the directions and it does it does have the directions three steps and on the back it says thank you for your purchase all right so very quickly I'm going to read the directions so we can try these lashes on Step number one, apply two coats of your Luxilia Magnetic Eyeliner. You can apply a single thick coat too. Along your lash line and let it completely dry. It will take one minute or two. Step two, gently remove your Luxilia Magnetic Lashes from the package and then place them as close to your lash bed as possible. Watch them lock into place. Step three, you can adjust your lashes as needed to get the correct placement. We highly recommend getting them as close to your lash line as possible so they blend seamlessly into your natural lashes. Okay, so three easy steps. We like that. I'll show you guys the tweezers a little bit more closely before applying the lashes. It has the name Luxilia right here at the tail of the tweezers. Pretty detail on the top. And yep, these are the tweezers. Okay. As a reminder guys, I think these tweezers are cute, but I tend to just use my hand, so that's what we're going to be doing here. Okay guys, don't mind me, I'm going to be looking off to the right and putting two thick coats of magnetic liner on my eyes. Which I don't mind because I like thick eyeliner as well as thick brows. This applicator here is super thin, so you kind of have to go over it to make it thick the line. Okay guys, so that's about at least two coats. It was probably a little bit more like three to make it nice and thick, but here are the lined eyes. We're going to Wait for it to, to dry completely as stated in the instructions and then we're going to be applying the lashes on. I really want the eyeliner to dry completely so I can properly review these lashes and I'm just going to wait it out. But in the meantime, I can show you guys a little bit more up close the five pairs of eyelashes that we have here as options. The feel of the lashes feels pretty natural, so I like that. You can see the magnets. It has one, two, three, four, five magnets, these pairs of eyelashes. And yes, they are visible. Okay, so the eyeliner is not completely dry. I just touched it. Did you guys see that? It like came up. So make sure you wait for them to dry completely. Like I'm fine. Like you don't have to worry about me. My anxiety is crippling, but I'm okay. Do you 
maybe I should talk to someone. Okay guys, so it's been two minutes and Peter's dry. Okay, so we're going to take the lashes and I'm going to be going with this pair of lashes here. Came off pretty easily. Once again, I'm going to be looking off to the right so I could see what I'm doing. I'm going to bend it a little bit before applying it just to get that natural curve going. Cute. Hey guys, so this is the set on me. What do you guys think? I think they're pretty cute. I apologize, my eyes are a little bit watery today. I think it's because I still have a little bit of allergies, but not a huge deal. They're staying on. Okay, so flick our test. Staying on. I like them, they're cute. <laughs> okay, so it's getting really hard to be extra picky with my review of these lashes that I try on for you guys because I feel like companies are stepping up their game when it comes to magnetic eyelashes because they know that the competition is out there. And yeah, all right, so Final thoughts on these lashes. Again, I've only tried one pair, but there's other ones to try. These I thought were in the middle, but more towards a little bit more of a morning lashes type of lashes. And I think they're super cute. They have a little wing going on. All right, so final thoughts. When it comes to hold, they they have a good hold like I could pull them off if I want to but at the same time you're seeing that like resistance so that's good feel the lashes felt pretty natural and they're not heavy they feel pretty good on my eyes and I like that you have five different pairs to choose from and as I've mentioned in other videos I am very big on packaging and I thought it was really cute how the tweezers are not just a pair of tweezers but they have their name here and the nice cute pink detail here same thing with the liner they have the name cute font that they have and let's talk about the actual box here not gonna be biased with the name because you guys already know how i feel about it, it has my pupper's name right here um but yes it's super cute i like that it's simple but it's sleek with the black and the silver and then the back it has a cute little you are so special to us which is pretty cute it says if there's any issues to contact them and give them a chance to make it right so that's just showing great customer service which again is always a plus and a big thumbs up from me and if i had to talk about any cons if i'm really um trying to give you guys both pros and cons so cons would be that it did take a little bit longer for the magnetic liner to dry compared to other lashes i have tried on a deal breaker just make sure you let the magnetic liner dry completely as is stated in the directions because if it's not completely dry it will be sticky and you don't want to put the lashes on when it's sticky so you definitely want to make sure uh even maybe doing the like the tap test touching the eyeliner before putting the lashes to see that it is dry and really guys I don't really have too many negative things to say about these lashes they are natural looking natural feeling cute magnetic eyelashes definitely another good option out there for you guys to try in case you guys are interested in trying out these lashes I will be including the Amazon link down below as well as other information about price and such all right guys well that wraps up today's video make sure you give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed this content so that i know to continue doing more in the future let me know down below also if you've tried these pairs of eyelashes or any other products that you guys might want me to try in the future i always appreciate your feedback and happy to engage with you guys in the comment section below thank you so much for watching stay safe and i will see you in the next one wait there's somebody that wants to say thank you for watching also hold on <laughs> 
tell them thank you so much for watching make sure you give a like <laughs>